Hi everyone. Abby here, or Luca, whichever site you're watching this from. I think I'm going to post it on a couple different ones. Because I don't know how long I'll be in here. Um, obviously, um, I'm in the hospital. Came in for bad asthma and throwing up blood and spitting it up and ended up getting admitted in the oncology unit which is a little nerve wracking I have to say I'm pretty lucky through both cancer battles so far I haven't had to be admitted to the hospital for any complications and this is the first one so I'm a little emotional I have my other half, Dylan, who's transgendered here. Say hi. Hello. Dylan doesn't like cameras. Not my favorite thing. You don't even want to poke over real quick? Mm -mm. With the nice hair? You just got your hair done. Mm -hmm. Pay $25, you're not going to show anybody? Dylan also, since I'm putting this on FA, is monster by because we're roommates so we look together. So anyway, I'm in here and I have Sprite cap. obsessed with Sprite. Anyway, I'm not sure how long I'm going to be in here, but I wanted to let everybody know that I am still on the site and actively like looking and reading and watching everything, the awesome art, and I'm also staying on Facebook for my Facebook friends because this is going up there too. So that's a good way to keep in contact with me. Um, huge thank you to my best friend Dixie and my adopted mama. Um, when Dylan left, um, they switched off basically because they didn't want to leave me alone, and they were here with me when I was moved up to this room. So they were with me through the initial shock whenever they told me, "Well, you're just going to go to the oncology unit," and I was super nervous my oxygen level low so they have me on this lovely creature with all kinds of like little tabbies and things they're not messing with my port over here because I have a phobia about that with hospital <laughs> call me crazy but anyway crazy shut up don't listen to him he's just a fox he doesn't know so, anyway, I'm going to turn this over there. The oncology rooms are a lot different than down the hall. Um, they have space for your loved one or your, usually your caregiver to spend the night. They have a whole bed over there for him, and they have a recliner, and the bed folds away during the day, so it's not in the way. There's plenty of chairs in here, and my own bathroom, and everything like that, and shower, and all that stuff. So, and a view of my city, which is just, it's not that interesting. It's Florida, but I'm hanging in. I'm just super nervous. The thing that was interesting was how big of an effect the unit had on myself and Dylan. I don't, I haven't, I don't bring anybody with me to my treatments because it's a way of how I control my cancer. And control the situation that's basically uncontrollable. It just makes me feel better. 
So this is like one of the first times that like it's surreal. Not like it hasn't been, but I mean I'm in that part of the hospital. Of all places for them to put me, they put me there. So, Dylan, what was your first reaction? Because I know you got here after I was moved up. And, um, Dixie was with me. And she's kind of eased herself into it, seeing her back story with her family's cancer journey and your cancer journey is with me. So how freaked out. Freaked out? Yeah. That's all? I was a bit ballistic looking for you. <laughs> Went little. Had a bit of a moment? Maybe. Hi. Anyway, having good hands for all my wonderful friends who were worried about me, both human and furry, and being well taken care of, they can monitor everything from out there, like my um, O2 levels low, so they have my oxygen, obviously, doing breathing treatments, pain management, yes creation of God. <laughs> like that is my life right now. It's not nice. It's like it's not fun. My magnesium was low, so I had to have magnesium too. Anyway. I don't know if there's anything else I want to say. What about you? Um, I guess. Thanks, Dixie, for switching out with me so I can go take a shower and get the good and stuff. This thing's vibrating in my nose that makes me feel awkward and violated. That's what she said. Oh, God, I'm stopping recording now. I love you all.